So here's a fun question for you. One of my favorites is "Die, Motherfucker, Die" on your, mm -hmm. you know, on your list there. How come Kids Bop has never asked you to do anything on their records? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why that is, but I will tell you a funny story about that song. Uh, that song, while it wasn't the most lucrative album, it made two different charts that. Uh, I found very peculiar. One was that it was in the top five songs used to torture people at Guantanamo Bay. And the other was uh, songs played uh, during the, uh, I guess it would be Desert Storm when, when we had troops in Afghanistan. Right. And um, I have mixed opinions on that. Yeah. Um, I was kind of like, oh, I don't know how I feel about that. And I still don't know about the Guantanamo Bay thing. But um, but as far as uh, as far as the soldiers in Afghanistan, I had a weird thing happen where I was um, I used to play with Joan Jett, and the runner that was taking us from the airport to the hotel, after he dropped everybody off, I'm like, hey, I need to go to the supermarket. Do you mind taking me? And he says, oh no 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 problem, you know. So I was like, okay cool. And he goes, are you AC Slade from Dope? And it's like that's always weird to me, like when yeah. it's like Joan Jett was sitting right there, like you know, why would you care about me when Joan right. Jett was right there? Right. And I'm like, well, yeah. How do you know about that? And he's like, well, you know, I, w I was a soldier in Afghanistan, and we used to listen to "Die, Motherfucker, Die" to, before we'd go into combat. And you know, we hated going into combat. Like it wasn't like something we looked forward to. It wasn't like we were like, okay, awesome, we got our orders to go in and, and shoot shit up because you know that means obviously people are get, getting shooting back at you, and some people aren't going to make it back. And we needed something to prepare ourselves and get us into a mindset to do something that we ultimately didn't want to do necessarily. And that changed my perspective on it. That kind of, you know, yeah. made, 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 made me comfortable with that. It's, it's always quite an honor when you get military personnel Absolutely. that tell oh, sure. you that yeah. your music helped them through their deployments. That's yeah. almost don't, uh, I never have any, I don't have the right words for it. You know, because right. it's it's such a, a big deal, and what we do is nothing compared to what they do. Oh, so. exactly. Yeah. yeah, they're the yeah. bravest, I would yeah. say. Hey, everyone! Thank you for watching our video. Subscribe to us on YouTube to see all of our interviews and backstage footage. Also, find us on our other socials by searching at BSE Rocks or by clicking the links below in the video. By becoming a fan of Backstage Entertainment. You can enter in contests to win autographed prizes. From Backstage Entertainment, I'm Jeremy LaFrance.